In this video I'll be showing the top 3 fastest XP farms for Borderlands 3 in 2023, so let's get started. Before we get into the methods, I'm first going to explain 3 ways on how to increase the amount of XP you can get. First off, you can come to this Borderlands science game machine located in Tannis' room on Sanctuary. You can play a minigame which earns you tokens and then you can use them tokens to purchase a 25% XP boost for 2 hours. The second thing you can do is get a Mox's Endowment Artifact, which has a 15% chance to drop from the Tink Train, who is located in the guts of the Carnivore map. And of course, the last thing you can do is play Mayhem 11. With that said, let's get into the methods. The first method is Katagawa Jr who is located in the Atlas HQ on Promethea. This boss is underrated for the XP as he is extremely easy to beat even on Mayhem 11. So I did a run of each XP method without an XP boost and then I did it again with an XP boost active. I then counted the XP afterwards when I looked back in the footage. I then timed the runs to find the average amount of time it takes to complete one run. In this case, Katagawa Jr gives 53,033 XP without an XP boost and 61,861 XP with one. The run on average should take around 30 seconds if you are on the next gen consoles. So with that in mind, you should be getting around an estimated 1,237,220 XP every 10 minutes if you have the XP boosts active. This is a great method for people who only own the base game and the boss is so easy it literally takes no time. The next method is the Psycho Billies located in the Amber Maya on Eden 6. This run is also really short and takes around 40 seconds if you include the loading screens. These enemies are a little more difficult than Katagawa Jr as there is 4 of them. In terms of the XP you can earn 97,845 without an XP boost and 110,883 XP with the XP boost active. So if you did this for 10 minutes and every run took around 40 seconds then you should be earning an average of 1,662,495 XP every 10 minutes and of course that is with the XP boosts active. Before I get into number 1, please consider subscribing to the channel if you are interested in everything Borderlands related. The best XP farm is the Scrap Trap Nest located in the compactor on the Handsome Jackpot. Most people probably would have guessed that this would be number 1, but the amount of XP you earn is actually insane, and it was very hard to add up all of the XP when I was going back through the footage. Without an XP boost, you can earn around 251,841 XP. And with an XP boost you can earn around 296,134 XP. This run takes around 1 minute 30 seconds, so if you did this for 10 minutes you can earn on average 1,776,804 XP with the boosts active. The great thing about this is you don't need to save, quit and reload, which makes this a really good farm for the people on old gen consoles. Instead what you can do is go to the edge of the arena, stand where I stand for around 5 seconds and then just go back in and then the enemies will respawn. If this video helped you out, please leave a like and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching and I hope you have a great day.